What's up guys? Welcome back to Skip's Guns. Before we get started, I want to say a huge thank you to all of my Patreon supporters, everyone who gets work done from my company, SGZ, as well as all of you guys for liking, subscribing, and sharing. Without you, I'm just a weirdo talking to a camera at the range. On top of that, Callaway Ballistics has joined up with SGZ and they have become the full-time ammo sponsor. So with that being said, I have a discount code for you guys down in the description below. It is not just a discount code. You also get free shipping. So go try to find something that gives you more of a discount than what that code gives you. No bullshit. That is some of the best ammo with one of the best discounts that you are going to find out there. Now, what do we have today? I don't know if you guys remember, but a couple of months back, I was starting to venture into the CZs to see, you know, just what we can do with this platform. As you guys know, I do have an Alien, and now I have two, and the grip angle is a really nice setup, so I wanted to kind of see what the CZs offer because their grip angle is very similar, and... I ended up picking up this CZ Shadow 2. So the gun already had a trigger job done to it, just internally, not the trigger itself. And what I ended up doing was I put a dual adjustable flat faced trigger in the gun and that gave it a really nice trigger pull. But then I went in and I started just kind of cleaning up things here and there, have an uh, adjustable sear. So that's going to give you a really, really fine-tuned setup. And that's kind of what I like, you know, when it comes down to triggers. Let's be honest, I'm a trigger snob. Uh, we do have the race hammer on it. I have a, I don't, I think this is the Eamon gas pedal. And then we have an extended, very hard to find thumb safety on here with a extended magazine release. I tried to make it as close as I could to how I set up my 2011s. We have a TLR1 up top, a direct mounted Trijicon SRO, which this is actually how the gun came with this setup. I put on these grips. This is more of like a golf ball texture. They are, I believe like a G10, very comfortable. And then this Magwell, of course, I believe, I think it comes on these guns. But the palm swells, like check this out, the palm swells of this thing really be made this gun feel a hell of a lot more like the palm swells on my Alien. So that really drew me to this setup. I actually had these grips on the other uh, shadow that I have, but I switched it over to this one because I knew I was doing these modifications. We did a recoil reduction and then I just got this back because I like to support my friends and Scott over there at Impact Machines hooked me up with some awesome ports as well as this kind of knurling that he does on the top here. Super clean and honestly I just I really like this setup and uh, let's take some of Callaway Ballistics 135 grain hollow tips and see how we go with this. I mean, right off the bat, the gun is just, it's a very flat shooter. It's a heavy gun, um, but with the ports and the recoil reduction, you can just feel, sorry, I got a tornado happening here. Uh, you can really just feel the gun a lot more now with those ports in it, and I think that uh, the gun without the ports is definitely a very nice shooter, but it could always be flatter. We actually did do an accu bushing in this as well. So the gun is already super accurate, but you put something like that in and now you add the recoil reduction of these ports and how much of the reciprocating mass you lose with doing what we did here. It really does give you quite a nice gun once you are set up. Let's see how we can do at 50. I mean, that's pretty awesome for 50 yards right off the bat for a shot up close. 
I can see why people like to use these guns as competition guns because this thing just literally wants to go absolutely ape shit every time I'm ready to pull the trigger. And that's the kind of stuff I like. So. I mean, you can really, really tell that this gun, it is such an improvement with these ports. Super stoked. And Scott over there at Impact Machines does some killer work. Now, I know it's kind of strange for one company to be pushing another company's work, but real has to recognize real here guys and this is what this channel is all about we're not here to just say that sgz is the best in the world we're just trying to say that you know we like to be in our lane and i like to jump on board with people that know their shit and impact machines knows cz's if you know a little bit of their background his dad is actually one of the owners of cajun gunworks i mean cajun gunworks literally offers the parts that I have in this thing. So yeah, I think they know what they're doing. You guys wanna see a little slow-mo? I know Ron does. So I'm going to take this time while I'm loading uh, just to kind of keep you guys up to date. So I have some shirts and I have some hats. And if you guys are interested, there is an email down below. Simply just shoot me an email and I will put you in uh, a nice hat and a nice shirt. We do have two different kinds of shirts. Uh, I don't have too many different sizes of the new version, but uh, I do have a couple of smaller uh, sizes for the small for the original version. And then the hat is a snapback hat, super comfortable. It is kind of like, uh, or not kind of, it is a Richardson's hat, so you know it's made of quality. And then the shirts are definitely more of a, a shirt like this where it's like a comfortable cotton but it's supposed to fit you it, it, not like a big baggy shirt it's supposed to kind of show off your muscles pretty much so i figured i would just take this opportunity to let you guys know that we do have shirts and we do have hats and i would really appreciate if you guys go take a look at them So obviously you guys have seen a good amount of footage for Impact Machine's port system. I did just kind of want to take a couple of seconds before I end this video by uh, showcasing a couple of different other options as well. So the whole way that I actually found out about this port system that we're showcasing today from Impact was I was working on my three little pigs setup. So this is actually going to go over all of the platforms. It's going to be the 1911, 2011, and obviously the CZs. And I just so happened to actually do it on my CZ Shadow. And this was more of like my test gun at that point. And then I found out about this and I was like, you know what? This is absolutely awesome. I love supporting my friends. Scott over there at Impact is an awesome dude. And I was like, you know what? Let's support another company. Let's get this done, and that way it'll be a good way to kind of gauge how this works against something like this. And so far, we are going to do a dedicated video to it, but just from knowing myself that this does shoot quite well, this is also an amazing alternative. So with that being said, I hope you guys enjoyed this portion of the video. Now I want to get you guys dressed to impress. Skips Guns shirts, Skips Guns hats, these are going to be available as of this video. Simply just go down in the description and there's an email. Email in and we will get you dressed to impress. 
if you are not looking to have a uh, skips gun shirt or a hat I have another company called range trotter that we are actually working with right now they were nice enough to send out a pair of sweatpants a pair of sweatpants shorts and then the shirt that I have on right now you'll see here in the b-roll this is the shirt it's kind of a mix between a uh, cotton but stretchy cotton is how I'm gonna put it it's a very comfortable shirt it fits nice to the body the whole point of range trotter as a whole is they are after replicating what us 90s kids used to dress like not only did you look good back in the 90s but you were comfortable and that's the whole point of them so they sent out this shirt it's not overdone you see it has the numbers 90 on the back it has just a little r down in the bottom of this uh, shirt itself their sweatpants are loose fitting but still fit really well so you're not just buying a, a really large pair of pants and putting them on they actually form fit to your style as well as the shorts they definitely have other stuff as well so if you could please go check out range trotter on instagram there's also a discount code you're going to find for them in the description as well and uh yeah guys hopefully sgz can upgrade stuff for you as well as now get you dressed to impress so i hope you guys enjoyed this video remember stay safe believe and achieve and we'll check you later